As we continue our quest to get you fit and feeling great this summer, that's coming up. We cannot forget the most important muscle in your body. That's right. It's your heart, if you haven't guessed. Dr. Rob's in the house to tell us how to protect it, man. Good to see you. Yeah, likewise. So, uh, there's a big study that came out that you're going to share with us, and there are these secrets that you're going to give to us to, to help us live longer. All sorts with the heart. You got it. Five really big secrets. It was an interesting study of men and women that made it to 100. And they found that there were five things that they had in common yeah. that helped them reach that age very healthful and youthful. And so we're going to share those five secrets today so that you can make it to 100 and be healthy too. What's the first one? Well, guess what? A trimmer body is a healthier body. So eating very healthful foods, yeah. very healthful proteins, chicken, turkey, fish, beef, eggs, light proteins like that, right? Okay. And then your leafy green vegetables and then eating plenty of healthy fats that you would find in omega-3s with the nuts and the avocados, right, and the olive oil, stuff right. like that. So eating healthy, keeping that trimmer body. What was really interesting is they found in their blood that there were five things that they had higher levels of, and we're going to share that with you today. Okay. One of those was they supplements, higher, right? yeah, supplements, okay. higher levels of omega-3s. So fish oils, uh -huh. higher level of fish oil in the blood. We'll take it a step further. I like the omega-10s yeah. because that's palmitoic acid, which is even stronger. So the omega-10s. Next thing, uh -huh. they had adequate amounts of magnesium. Get that. Magnesium is very important because magnesium helps your heart contract. Okay. Helps it do what it needs to do. And so these supplements would help you. Yes, get exactly. That. Okay. So they found that the people that made it to 100 had higher levels of magnesium. They found they had higher levels of CoQ10 in their blood as well. And what does Another that do? Another supplement. It helps energize and power up the heart. Okay. So remember, we're talking about heart health here. Yeah. You got that. The most important muscle in the body is that heart. <laughs> Next, they found they had higher levels of vitamin C. Hmm. So if you're not eating your fruits and vegetables, right. so you get that vitamin C, you definitely need a supplement. They found 500 milligrams four times a day of vitamin C. Can I ask you this about vitamin C real quick? Is there, can you ever have too much of vitamin C? No, you cannot. It's a water-soluble vitamin, so if you take in too much, you're just going to pee most of the way. Okay. I like to use the esterified vitamin C with citrus bioflavonoids. If it's esterified, it has calcium attached to it. Yeah. helps your body absorb more of it. Very good, very good. The I next like thing they found is they had high levels of multivitamins in their blood. So vitamins, because you always hear about that. Are vitamins good? Are vitamins do anything for you? So apparently they do. If, they do. If they do. They'll help you make it to 100. And they found that these five substances, they had higher levels in their blood. Definitely. So what else is it that you can do besides yep. being healthier and trim your body and making sure that you're taking plenty of your Pump vitamins? Up. Regular daily exercise. Uh -huh. The next thing that they found that these individuals did is they found that they made time to either relax or meditate. That's interesting too. Would you consider maybe like um, you know in, in anything meditation as far as just simply being quiet, simply being quiet, being. taking time for yourself to decompress, relax, get yeah. the stress out of your body. It's very important. The next thing they found is all of these individuals visited their doctor on a regular basis to make sure everything was okay. Take that a step further. Yep. Make sure you're getting your annual heart exams. That you're getting carotid ultrasounds to look for plaque in the neck, vascular occlusive testing to look for endothelial dysfunction. Yep. And I don't know if you've been driving down 75, 725, the mm -hmm. Kettering building. Yes. The big sign. Huge. How much is your heart worth? Right? So, yep. five star health grade hospital encouraging you to get your annual exams. They're doing CT uh, calcium scores to take a look at your ha yep. heart health to see if you have calcium blockage. In your and heart. of course, those tests are very important. Visit your local doctor or if you wanted any of these tests as well, uh, Dr. Rob does offer these too at the Alpha Male Institute. More information, the website's on your screen. Dr. Rob, thanks so much for coming.